shall be suspended beginning 15, 2020. It's a new day for Victoria. Young as she is, she has awakened to the reality of life. Reality that life is not easy, it is even harsh. At a young age, she has to put her shoulder to the wheel so that life will push along. So sad for her, she has to work at a young age to make the ends meet. Would she be thankful to the school for it is where she is given a chance to rest? Or for the school to be sorry for her rest yields her nothing but a lot behind? It's Victoria, a pupil of Mercedes Elementary School in Mercedes Camarines North, a coastal town where everyday living is anchored on the temper of the sea. As it's raging in anger, it's an almost empty stomach. At times when it is calm, it's an affluent life for Mercedes. It's now school year 2022-2023, a time to rejoice and celebrate the COVID's loosening up and announce. The most celebrated word this time is face-to-face, -face, further from the destructive and deadly virus. Slipping away from the grip of COVID-19, Mercedes Elementary School has become stronger and free to address challenges in teaching and learning process, especially in terms of numeracy. Face-to-face, -face, it was addressed. Saying goodbye to the unseen enemy, even though not totally, the more that the school has become resolved to come up with project and innovation dubbed as Matibay. A title that connotes the school's tenacity and resiliency to enhance and strengthen more the numeracy skills of the clientele. Mercedes Elementary School has not lost heart for the victorious affected by the COVID-19. In its quest to continuously cater quality education to the clientele, it has furthered its innovations continuing the ones constituted in the Smartmatic which were implemented during the height of the pandemic. The factors have affected the performance of the learners from face-to-face -face classes. It is evident in the result of numeracy test which shows 97.78% for primary and 100% for intermediate. It is hard for the teacher to advance the lesson considering that even the basics are beyond the comprehension of the learners. With the furtherance of the innovations implemented during the COVID-19, the school aims to increase the performance level in mathematics, strengthen more the relationship between the school and the stakeholders, and fill up the limitations brought about by COVID-19. It is through face-to-face mode of learning that Matibay come into the picture as the continuation of the Smartmatic which was implemented during the height of the COVID-19. In Project Matibay, Letter T comprises teachers' provisions on remediation, enrichment, and varied learning activities. How numeracy remediation is done? Each grade level has come up with its own project on the provision of remediation to the learners who are lagging behind as Victoria. Remediation is done during the vacant time of the teachers and it could also be after class. With the remediation come along enrichment and varied learning activities that come in either formal lesson or games to make the pupils more interested to learn. Another is the Kapubalko Katuwangko. Kapubalko Katuwangko is a type of remediation in which a chosen pupil tutor is selected from any section to provide morale support to those learners who are lagging behind. The pupil tutors are awarded with certificate of commendations at the end of the quarter to be replaced by another tutor for the successive month. As a result, Learning among students will be more fun and interesting if they are involved in the transfer of knowledge 
rather than being a passive receiver. Pagkatawa ang naging reaksyon ko nung malaman kung kasama ko sa mga magkututor sa mga bata. Madadagdagan ang mga bata ng pagkakaintindi sa matematis. Masaya po ako sa natutupo pa rin. The letter I stands for innovations that comprises instructional materials, booklets, and activity sheets. Teacher never stops coming up with innovative instructional materials to capture the learner's interest toward the lesson. Booklets are also crafted by the teachers and they also prepare manipulative devices and video lesson to make the learning more fun and exciting. Furthermore, also included in the teacher's innovation is the construction of math park in the school campus. Based on our observation and evaluation, we can say that pupils' performance and attitude toward mathematics is improving. The letter B stands for Bahay ko, Classroom ko which constitutes of installed learning corner at home of the learners with the assistance of the teacher. The school taps the cooperation of the teacher applicants who reside in the place of the learner to serve as their tutor. It indeed takes an entire village to mold a child, and Victoria is indeed one of them. Materials na ay makakatulong sa pag-aaral ng aking. The letter A stands for assessment. Instructions will be futile without assessing the outcome. In this innovation, assessment veers away from its usual form. It is done through mini quiz show, bingo bonanza, and contest in a form of games that are integrated with mathematical concepts. The letter Y stands for yield. What the teachers sow brings so much yields. As a result of the teacher's effort to provide quality numeracy learning to the clientele, the support of the stakeholders spontaneously come to school. As a support to this are learning centers located in each barangay. Its management is shared by the school and the community where it is located. With the presence of Matibay, the teacher became more driven to come up with learning and assessment materials. Cooperation became more evident among them. Moreover, their imagination and creativity were greatly improved. With the implementation of Matibay, Increase in the performance level in mathematics is evident in the innovative assessment activities conducted by the school and the result of their first quarter test. The relationship between the school and the community is strengthened by the activities in the innovation that call for cooperation between the school and the parents. Furthermore, the learning challenges brought about by the pandemic were addressed through reaching out and creativity on the part of the school. With the said innovations, teaching and assessment have become a shared task among the teachers. It is not only the learnings of the pupils which was improved, but so do with the teachers' rapport among them and their teaching skills. It is the vision of Mercedes Elementary School to have the aforementioned innovation to be a regular part of the school's teaching and learning activities. It envisions to have the innovation benchmarked by other schools, continuously inspire and support the teachers and stakeholders for a smooth partnership, strengthen the relationship between the school and the community, and fill up limitations brought about by COVID-19. Mercedes Elementary School used to grapple with COVID-19 but was not subdued. Will it let itself be now that COVID-19 has loosened its grip on us? The answer, it's Matibay!